The fact that Tom Brady is a freak of nature cannot be overstated. Brady is the only quarterback in NFL history to have thrown for as many touchdown passes as he has, and he's doing so at the age of 44, which is an incredible feat. There have only been a few quarterbacks who have played as long as Brady has, breaking records left and right. In addition, there are still four games left in the regular season, giving Brady plenty of opportunity to continue his ascent up this list. Brady has thrown 700 touchdown passes in his career, including touchdowns in the postseason and regular season. The following are the top five quarterbacks in terms of total touchdowns during the regular season and postseason. Aaron Rodgers is the fifth highest scoring quarterback in NFL history with 484 touchdowns and counting. While Aaron Rodgers has established himself as one of the most talented quarterbacks in the entire NFL, he still has a long way to go before catching up with the leaders on this list, which includes Tom Brady. Rodgers presently has 439 touchdown passes in the regular season, a total that is surely going to rise over the rest of his career. If I had to pick a winner today, Aaron Rodgers would be my choice. Some claim that he has weapons. I guess MVS catches a 50-yard touchdown pass once every few weeks, which is true. Following Devontae, his top receivers are a running back and a 31-year-old slot receiver. Rodgers is the master of getting more done with less. In addition, Rodgers has 45 playoff touchdowns, which is roughly half of Brady's total. If the Packers make the playoffs, which is almost a foregone conclusion, he will be able to close the gap on Brady's stats substantially. Both players are well known for being touchdown machines. At number 4, Brett Favre at 552 touchdowns. When it comes to quarterbacks in the NFL, Brett Favre is another superstar who has thrown an absurd number of touchdown passes during the time in the league. Prior to being replaced by Aaron Rodgers, Favre spent the majority of his career in Green Bay. On the other hand, Favre is considered to be one of the all-time greats at the quarterback position. Favre finished his career with 508 touchdowns in the regular season. That record was further inflated by 44 touchdowns in the postseason, bringing his total to 552. In addition to losing his job to Rodgers, Favre has had his playoff touchdown total decrease by one thanks to Rodgers. At number 3, Peyton Manning with 579 touchdowns. Also on this list are Peyton Manning and Tom Brady, both Hall of Fame quarterbacks who have gone above and beyond with touchdown throws. He played the majority of his football career with the Indianapolis Colts before concluding it with the Denver Broncos in his last seasons. Peyton totaled 539 touchdowns in the regular season throughout that span of time. Peyton's total number of postseason touchdowns is less than the number 5 and number 4 players on this list. A total of 40 touchdown passes were completed during the playoffs, bringing his all-time total to 579. Peyton Manning is a legend, despite the fact that he has less postseason touchdowns. At number 2, Drew Brees with 608 touchdowns. Drew Brees recently announced his retirement, bringing his career total of 608 touchdowns to an end. Also a former San Diego Charger, Brees began his career with the team before going on to have a great career with the New Orleans Saints. While doing so, he was responsible for 571 touchdowns during the regular season. His playoff touchdown total was 37, and it will remain his total for the rest of the season. Brees will be a first ballot Hall of Fame quarterback when the time comes for him to receive his gold jacket, regardless of how well he performed in the playoffs. And at number one, with a total of 700 touchdowns, is Tom Brady. Tom Brady is the undisputed leader in total touchdowns, with 617 in the regular season and 83 in the postseason. The seemingly immortal superstar is still breaking records well into his 40s, and it doesn't appear like he will be stopping anytime soon. Brady completed his 700th total touchdown pass during today's game, and he did it in grand fashion. Having put the game on the line, Brady delivered a perfectly placed throw in stride to Brashad Perriman, who ran it in for the game-winning touchdown from 58 yards away. Brady will add on to this total during the remainder of his career, but it is still an incredible accomplishment that deserves to be recognized. Well guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Be sure to smash that like button, subscribe to any sport, and hit that notification bell so that you never miss a video. See you all next time.